So by now, you're probably done with the annual wrap and reboot guide, or you've got a really good plan to get her done. So thank you. Thank you for taking time to experiment with this tool, with this technique. I appreciate you giving it a try. I'd love to hear from you on one of my social media outlets of how this worked. You're exceptional. It's really about 5% of the population that will take the time to write goals and to follow up and to think about what am I doing? What am I doing well? What can I do better? 5% of the population, you are exceptional. My hope and prayer is that this guide helped you uh, to be more intentional along the way. I'm going to share a little bit about who I am and what I do and why. I have a link to my bio in the email, so you can really click on that if you want more. But a few things that kind of come to mind. My business is much different today than it was when I started in 2007. Over the years, I've helped business owners build a profitable business and have a good life. Get, I used to say, uh, help people build profits and get a life because so many times people were doing one or the other. That's transformed over the years to me helping those same business owners and many others develop their communication skills and their emotional intelligence to become better leaders. What people have told me is that I'm fun to work with. And I used to think that wasn't a very important thing, but man, life is too short not to have fun. Another thing that I've been told is that I show up. I'm really engaged and present with my clients when I meet with them. And I really like, I love even the model of coaching is so much about being in the moment. It feels pretty powerful to my clients based on what they've told me. I really am for risk taking, safe, modest risks and helping people get out of their comfort zone. And a lot of times we need help doing that. We need support. I want to invite you to take some next steps with your own personal development. Uh, we, and I have a link to this in the email. There's an online course we have, and it's one of our three master courses that are included in the Lead Well program, and it's called Personal Mastery. It really takes you through four steps to really uh, pretty much, it's, it's the, it's the uh, best abbreviated summation of what I can give you virtually, meaning there's videos, worksheets, uh, short kind of micro lessons on how to become your best. And it's really what I do with clients. It's all of my years of work poured into this master course. So you can get that. It's on our site. The third thing I would say and invite you to consider is our Lead Well program. Leaders participate in this group program. And we have group sessions for nine months. You have, some you have four individual sessions. And you have some master courses that you go through on your own and then we work on that and practice those skills in let's call it a safe environment kind of a place where you can practice vulnerability that's really a hot topic that so many leaders want to get better at but where do you practice that so in our lead well program which is a great either shot in the arm for a leader who's been leading for a lot of years. If you're in, new into leadership, it can be a great sort of orientation and development into some wonderful communication skills. The whole program is based on emotional intelligence. I hope you've enjoyed this time going through the wrap guide. I hope you found uh, somebody to do the annual wrap and reboot with. Whether you're doing it in January or July, it doesn't matter because we all have our own sort of annual process and whatever yours is, make it yours. So you can share that wrap guide with family, friends, your colleagues. Maybe you even meet as a group and go through the three sections together. I've had book clubs go through the guide together. I've had therapists get the guide and go have a retreat. So if there's industry peers that you want to meet with, it's just a really good uh, discovery process to go through and share some of your answers. I want you to remember that uh, I'm here in your corner, so reach out if you have questions or you want to look at what a good next step is for you. And remember, live intentionally.